What up, y'all? It's your girl, maybe. So I decided to do a little vlogging for y'all today. And uh, vlogging, vlogging, whichever one it's called. And um, tell y'all about this Ubering thing. So, you know, so, so far I've had like three very quiet riders that wouldn't talk, that just were like, I'm not talking to you. I don't care what you say. I was like, hey, how are you? Hey, trying to be nice. They were like, they weren't talking. So I, now I let people uh, initiate like, hey, how are you? Oh, hey, how are you? And then if they continue talking, then we talk. But if not, then we don't because it's weird. And then I found out, y'all, this whole time I've been accepting fares, they were the car fares, not um, the Uber XL fares. So now I'm parked in H-E-B parking lot. Very much parked. Just sitting here. Just sitting here waiting on, you know, my little ding, ding, ding to go off and to tell me that I have a ride. Because, well, I guess it's wasting gas to drive, but am I not wasting gas by sitting here using the air too? Is that not the same? Or I don't know about cars like that. I just drive them. So somebody tell me down below, like, is it using the same amount of gas if I drive or if I park using the air? Like, so if I'm parked using the air, does it use the same amount of fuel? Is if I'm driving and using the air? Does it? I don't know. But this is like my fourth day. I've made like, $180 already, but that's because I was doing like $3 rides, $5 rides. I did like two $30 rides and they were far. And I was like, dang, like $5 for 11 miles. Like that's crazy to me. You know, I can't, I kept saying, I don't understand this, but I didn't know that Uber X meant a car and just Uber XL was just for, you know, means, issues. So now I know, so I'm in my car. It's all nice and clean. Make sure that it's good for all my little passengers. You know, well, ain't nobody sitting up here anyway. But I'm just saying, um, you know, it smells good. I, oh, I bought this to use to make it, where is it? Where is it? I use this to make it smell good in here. It really makes it smell really good. And then I have Lysol too that I spray after people get out because I don't want no cooties, you know what I'm saying? And people be coughing and sneezing and farting and stuff, and you know, I don't got time for none of that. But, so yeah, I've been parked here for about five minutes or so, and I haven't got a ding yet. So it makes me like want to turn the car thing on and like get the little money, but I know it's not worth it because it's running out my gas. But then again, Am I running out my gas by just sitting here using the air? Cause I damn sure ain't turning the air off and sitting out here in this hot heat. I'm not doing that. So I'm really confused. Like I'm really confused. Like, am I supposed to, would it be better if I drove around, wait till some dings? Or should I just sit and use the air? Or should I take the little bitty routes? They're only $5 for like 11,000 miles. <laughs> I don't know what to do, guys. Any Ubers help me out? Like, <sighs> I don't know. And, and am I gonna get any rides that are like worth the money anyway, either way? Like, I don't know, guys. I'm trying to figure this out. Like. I'm really trying to figure it out, but I'm excited about it regardless. Like, I don't know, I, I, I'm excited. Y'all may think that like, it's weird or goofy or something that I'm excited about it, but I'm, I'm excited to make money. I love seeing the little coins add up in my little thing for the day, the little tally of the day. I'm like, hey, you know, but I mean, not if it's like, I could have made more money, but right now I'm not making no money. And I could be taking those little rides making money. So I don't know. But then they said if I pass up on those rides, 
then it like, goes against me. I'm like, goes against me as far as the way. So I got the app on just sitting there. Does that not go against me because it's not doing anything? Like, girl, I don't know. I'm trying to figure this Uber shit out. <laughs> but I'm having fun doing it regardless. Like, I'm having a ball just trying to, <laughs> trying to figure it out. I got my little camera. Let me show y'all my camera. I got my camera. You know, I got the 360 cameras all around the truck too, so, you know, but I don't know. I'd be excited to get a ride. And then when I get a ride, I'd be super nervous when people get in. And then when they don't talk, it makes me even more nervous. And then the fact that I'm not even familiar with like half of the places out here. Like I only know the area I live in. It makes it even, and I really don't want to drive like in downtown Houston or nothing like that. Like. I really rather stay around where I'm at, you know? So I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna just keep going and this day four, y'all. So I'm gonna try to vlog every day and tell you how my day is. So at the end of the day, I'm gonna tell you how my day was today. So this is my starting and then I'll probably come at the middle and or maybe just come at the end, I don't know. I'll probably just come at the end so I can tell you what happened for the whole day. So this is day four, and this is my first day vlogging it. So we'll see what happens, guys. And I'm gonna ask some of the people like, hey, do you wanna be on camera with me? And see if after the ride, if the ride is over, if they'll say hi. But I don't know if I can do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask somebody first, cause I don't wanna get in trouble. All right, y'all, and I will talk to y'all in a bit. Bye. All right, y'all, day four done. This is what happened today. So I had, 10 rides, I think. Let's see. I don't know. How do I know how many rides I had? Let's look and see. Because I don't want to lie to y'all. I want to keep it 100% honest. Let's see. How many rides did maybe have today? How many trips? Oh, I had 11 completed trips. And this is how much money I made. For those that can't see, I made $87.73. And I got 43 points today, and I made 11 trips completed, period. Now, let me tell you. Okay, so I never had a shared ride before where it would pick up one person and then turn around and pick up somebody else in, in the same ride. It was like, whoop, share fare, boop, and then put somebody else in the ride where I had to go scoop them up real quick and go on ahead and uh, pick them up. So... And I never knew that Ubers pick people up on the side of the curb. I literally had to pick people up off the side of the street by the light. And I'm like, uh, this is kind of weird because, like, it's kind of dangerous to me because, like, I'm holding up traffic and y'all take it forever to get the, in the car. Then I picked up some people from a weed dispensary, honey. And I didn't even know that they had weed dispensaries in Houston, Texas. That, you know, because I thought we wasn't legal here. But apparently, because <laughs> I saw it, it was it was a wheat dispensary. That was very nice. And then I had one girl I picked up, and she she was uh, coming from the hearing uh, place, and she was deaf. And that was really nice dealing with her because... I've never had to try to communicate with somebody who's deaf before. So I'm like learning all kind of different peoples and different stuff and like, um, not different kind of peoples, but like, I don't know how you explain it. Like people from different walks of life, people with, you know, different um, abilities and disabilities. Um, I've met homeless people already. They got kicked out of their house because they couldn't afford their rent. They told me their their story. And then I met a man with a leg that was cut off. I met a lady whose arm was cut off from diabetes, both of them. And then um, one girl was mad because she didn't get to eat her lunch because she was at a four hour uh, conference at work. So she was pretty pissed off. She got in the car, she was mad. Mm -hmm. Then people keep booking and having their kids try to get in the car with me. And I don't know if that's okay or not okay. So I'm glad that uh, I canceled them. And then um, 
had to find out if I could pick up kids or not because um, I canceled the trips because I didn't want to get in trouble. So, you yeah, know, that part. So I had a very eventful day. It was cool. Yeah, and then the other day I picked up some people that were going to a bachelorette party. They were asking me where to turn up at. You know, so this is my vlog of um, day four, okay? I picked up a lot of people today. It was a lot. I picked up two people from H-E-B that worked there, took them home. I picked up a girl from her house and took her to the kid's school, dropped her off there. Um, because she didn't want to walk. I picked up a girl and took her from right from her apartment complex to the liquor store. And it was two feet away. And then dropped her back off. And I couldn't understand that ride. But hey, I got paid for it. So who cares? So, so far day four, I made $87. It's the highest amount that I made. But the only reason why I didn't make more money is because I was trying to do XL all morning. Instead of just picking, and then finally I got fed up around 3.30 and was like, babe, I'm going to do whatever route I can get. And then boom, made $80, $87 in three hours. So, so there's, I made that $87, but I made it in three hours. So if I would have worked all day, like from 12 to, uh, what time did I quit? 6.30? From 12 to 6.30, I feel like I would have doubled that. So we'll see what tomorrow has to bring. I think I'm going to vlog every day to tell y'all my experiences and what I go through and, you know, what fun moments I have, what funny moments I have. And I'm not disclosing anybody's name. So I feel like I can talk about whatever the fuck I want because I'm not telling nobody's name. Okay. So if y'all want to hear about my Uber experience and vlogs and y'all want me to go live i mean not go live if y'all want me to keep making videos to tell y'all about my experiences while i'm ubering being a social media influencer and i put it on the app so when i pick them up they know i'm an influencer because i put it on there so anywho um thank y'all for watching god bless y'all do y'all like my messy bun today it's kind of cute huh Anyway, I love y'all. God bless y'all. And I can't wait for tomorrow's vlog. Let's get it.